On October 11, 2023, deputies responded to the scene of a crash in which the suspect refused to give his information, then fled the scene. What did he look like? Middle-aged, Caucasian male, small handlebar mustache. How does pressing charges work? That's up to the state. Okay. So um, we'll go find them and, you know, if we have probable cause to arrest them, we will. saying is he was in the right time lane and the guy went around to the right. So the deputy was able to track down the suspect at his workplace. I'm looking to see if you have an employee there that drives a it's like a brown or tan Honda CRV. It's a SUV. Likely would have just gotten to work about 10 15 minutes ago. Oh, I think I do. Yes. Yeah, um, he was wearing a Pender shirt. He was involved in a crash and left. I need his information so oh, I can get a hold of him. Is he still there? Um, he is, yeah. Okay. Um, if you want to just let him know not to leave. Um, yeah, he's working with my one of, with my manager down there, so we're on watering plant. So he's okay. He's, he's here, not, so I, I'm, he's not, not gonna, I'm he's, not going to say anything if that's okay. If you want. Me yeah, to no, I I don't want you to. Um, the, is he required to be dispatched to do anything today, or is he supposed to just be working there on the grounds? He's just supposed to be working on the grounds. Okay. And uh, what's his name? Yeah, he was uh, he was, he was involved in a crash, uh, hit and run actually. He tried to. Oh, man. Somebody was in a right turn I lane. And, is, I think this is his. I think it's his vehicle, but um, I can go check down there and see. I don't. I don't know. I don't. I don't take any of the license numbers or anything like that. But I can go, like down there. Um, it's just on the other side of the property. If you give me a few moments, I can walk down there and just confirm that that's him. Okay, sure. But I, I think that's it. I see Thank him you. On the has a brown vehicle. I appreciate it. Yes. Yeah. I'm so sorry. No, it's, you have no reason I to hope apologize. Okay. <laughs> I know, but yeah, that's, just, that's not what I would expect from anybody. How are you today? Okay. Uh, is Zach here? Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, I mean, no, I didn't know if he called down. He said he had some issues this morning, so I No, he didn't call us. Okay. Where is he at? Um, what, did, um, what did Zach tell you happened today? Oh, no, he was in a little fender bender. I oh. guess he, he had taken care of it, so oh, that's okay. I, I didn't know if he called you. I saw you pulling in. <laughs> How did he take care of it? Did he tell you? I don't know. No? Oh, okay. I don't know. All right, thanks. Is Zach here? Yeah, okay. and I did look at the car, and I took a picture of the license yeah, plate. Yeah, I so took I a picture of it okay. also. I guess right. he told one of the employees over there that he was involved in a fender bender this morning, but I guess told her that he took care of it or something. I don't know. Okay. Right. So you want me, you want me to change his Zach? Yeah. All right. Yep. How's it going? It's okay. Okay. Yeah, a guy hit me from behind. I was turning right on that busy intersection there, doing everything perfect, everything was on, and um, I turned right and he smashed into me. I had a big white truck. He obviously was looking on his phone. I popped out because I was trying to run to work here. I'm new here, so I was a little nervous. And then I said, did you hit anything? And then he was saying, you did this, you did that. And I'm going, dude, you hit me from behind, you know. And then um, I just took a picture because I wanted to get to work really fast. And I didn't even really notice. It looked like my car was okay, but actually he broke the back of my left um, signal. He smashed it, I noticed. So I came into work. Then I said, oh, and I wasn't even late to work. So, and then I said to the... Um, my manager you know this happened and she goes next time just stop call here tell them da 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 but i didn't think anything had happened he was being obnoxious i just thought just get to work i took a picture of his license but it came out fuzzy i can show you so i couldn't really see it so then i took it but i'm sure his car was fine he has a giant thing it was me i think i was completely in the right and i would like to 
file for insurance because, you know, I think it's clear what happened there, so. Okay, I need you to walk up front with me. All right. Yeah, you can right. you can take your apron off and all that kind of stuff. You're not going to need that right now. Okay. Yeah. Let's take a walk. Do you have your ID on you? It's it's in my car. You got a knife on you or anything like that? No. Pruning shears. Okay. Oh, I have. Yeah. Yeah, I thought when I got out, he would at least say I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that section that's very scary. You know, turning right onto 713. I was just being. I was in the right lane. Had my signal on. Was just being a little cautious and was moving in, and then he hit me. And you can see. Yeah, I thought That's, you said nothing happened to your car, though. I didn't see it at first, but no. I, it, it, it was. You told me that you took a photo of his license. Do you have that on you? I do, but um, my phone is up there. But it was real blurry, you know? Uh, it was a white truck. Maybe you can read the, Maybe you can do some special thing to read the numbers. But. Uh, Okay. Yeah. Did you provide him with any of your information? No, I didn't think anything had happened. I was, like I said, I was worried. This is a new job. I've only been here a week and a half. What are you looking for in your car? I was going to get my ID. But oh, no. Uh, yeah. Okay. I, I, All right. Fine. All right. And um, let's go into the sub. Yeah. So I didn't, you know what I mean? It's like all this traffic's happening. It was an angle. I didn't, if you look here, it looks like nothing happened. Mm -hmm. He hit me and I felt the jolt, but I felt like I'm okay. So everything over here? Mm-hmm. Everything yeah. over there. Do me a favor. Turn around. Put your hands behind your back. Put your palms together. Put your hand. Put your palms yeah, together. Over, put your palms together. Right. Yeah, there you go. All right. I'm placing you under arrest for hit and run. Okay. Your version right. of the story is very different from reality. Oh. Okay. You went around the gentleman that was already in a right turn lane, and there's a camera there at that intersection. Hit his vehicle. I did. You did. And then you left without providing any information, okay? That wasn't my experience at all. Okay. Well, there's reality and then there's your experience. Well, so the I, reality of what happened is what I just explained to you. How did I go around him when... Um, when well, there's a bicycle lane him? and people do it all the time when they're in a rush. I didn't which go, is probably I why you told him you were in a rush and had was, to get to work. He was always, he was behind me the entire time. How could I have ever been, uh, gone around him? He was behind me the entire time. Yeah, let's walk over to your car for a second. Wait, how is could I have gone around him when I was in front of him the entire time? He are you crazy. asking me to explain the possibility of how that's possible, or are you asking me to recreate an event that I wasn't there for? Ron, okay. Because the possibility aspect of it is that people do it all the time, even though it's illegal because they're in a rush. And you already told me you were in a rush. And his account know. of the events makes much more sense than yours. Because he actually stayed on the scene of a crash, which is required by Florida State statute. See, I'm new to Florida, so I don't know all these things. I just thought it's okay. Do you have anything inside your shoes? No. I'm taking you to jail for hit and run. Let me know now if there's anything so we can deal with it now. Can I call my friend? Rather than at, listen what, what, to me for a second. Okay. Do you have any contraband on you at all? No. Okay. All right, come with me. I'll come back for your stuff. Can I get my... Can I call my friend? I don't even have my phone. Can I get my phone? I will grab your phone for you, sure. I'm new to Florida. I don't understand all these things. He obviously has been in other accidents. Well, I, I would... Said, I would he said, uh, that, that's not how it's done, buddy, and, and obviously he's been Right, so you probably should have, should have listened to him. I just was nervous about work. I'm new here. I'm pretty sure know. there's no state in the United States that says, hey, you can get in an accident and then leave. I, I, I haven't been in an accident in like, like 20 years. Okay. You're, you're just shooting me a whole bunch of excuses, man, instead of taking responsibility. Well, Go I ahead. just don't know. I, Go ahead and get in. All right. Can I get my phone? I, just, I already told you, you're, you're, you're repeating yourself a lot now. I'm okay. sorry, I'm sorry. I this told is, you I'll get your phone for you. This is a new experience for me. Okay. That's stuff. Yeah, that's it. I didn't know if we needed anything else. Okay, that can suck and probably stay here. Okay. Um, they'll have a bond so you can get out with, probably okay. within a couple hours. So. Okay. All right? All right, cool. All right. Thank you. Have a good one. Yeah, you too. Thank you. Um, his account is that the guy... Um, in the Tacoma was behind him the entire time and came up and hit him from behind. 
which wouldn't wouldn't make sense based on where the damage is, but we still need to dispel that the best that we can. Right. Um, and, you know, if there's video footage, great. If not, we'll look at the damage again. Okay. So, but obviously he's not going to jail because he was involved in a crash. He was going to jail because he got involved in a crash and left. Right. So, do you have a driver's license? Because when I look you up, you don't have a Florida driver's license. For the man stated he had a Massachusetts driver's license that was expired and kept ranting about how everything wasn't his fault, even though he left. Well, you said it was a big truck. It wasn't a big truck. It was a small white truck. It was a Toyota Tacoma factory, not lifted or anything. And he did have damage. He had a lot of damage, actually. The, your Massachusetts license is expired as well. Give me a quick rundown before we get out real quick on how the crash happened again. Okay. Now this is a, sep like, again, I told you before, this is a completely different investigation into the crash. I'm asking because of the criminal nature of everything. started to approach into the right lane uh, and then just as I was in the right lane my experience was that he hit me from behind I was jolted I whipped and I pulled over to the right uh, to see if there was damage I was a little shocked and so it might take me a second I pulled over to the right hopped out of my car he didn't get out um, I quickly looked and you know the sun was such that I didn't see any damage. I, you know, to me he had a big white truck. That's the way I call it a white truck. I just, you know, it was a larger vehicle than mine. Um, and I didn't see the damage on my thing. He was. I thought he would apologize because it was clear he hit me from behind. He didn't. He was. He was kind of nasty. He was saying some story, and I said that's ridiculous. I said. He goes, well, um, you know, and I said, what do we do? Do you want to exchange number? He said, um, you, we have to pull into the gas station. I said, I don't have the time. I don't see any damage. He goes, well, that's the way it's done, buddy. So obviously he has more experience than me in, in accidents. I mean, part of this was my stupidity and ignorance because I haven't been in an accident. And I said, it's okay. I've got to go. He was taking pictures of my license, so I, I went to the back to get a picture of his license in case... By license, you mean license plate, case, right? license plate, in case anything, you know, in case I needed it. Did you ever give him any of your information? I didn't. I no? didn't think, okay. you know, it was my stupid fault, but I didn't think anything had happened. I thought, I'm still not late for work. It was his fault. He's getting off easy. I'm just going to go. And I didn't think it was a hit and run or anything like that. I mean, it's total ignorance on my part. Okay. But uh, if there's any camera footage, I would be certain that it would show that my story is the correct one. Okay, we're going to get out and go inside the jail now. All right. All right.